Powellhurst Gilbert neighborhood. Coin Local 6 reporter Jessica Morkert is live there tonight. And Jessica, there was a blind man inside the home? There was Kelly, but Portland police were able to, Portland Fire rather, were able to get to him before it was too late. And he was asleep here on this mattress. Take a look at this. It is destroyed. But the good news here is that crews were able to get into that, this house and get him out within about five minutes or so. So an incredible job on their part. But this little guy, a Pomeranian named Sugar Bear, is also being credited for helping today. Her owner, Sandra Jones, has had her for about 10 years, says she's a, she rarely ever barks and that she's a mild, loving dog. Sandra says Sugar Bear knew something was wrong and barked. So she woke up and heard the fire alarms and realized that her roommate, who is blind, was downstairs. The firemen had to go in and get him out because he was not coming out. And then they went and got him and put him on the gurney and then they took him to the hospital. But I don't know, but yeah, if it wouldn't, I'm a very hard sleeper. <laughs> and if it wouldn't have been for her, I would have been asleep. And he probably would have died of inhalation smoke. And, we would have been gone too. Scary thought. We're told the victim here has a bad burn on his foot. He was taken to the hospital, but he is supposed to be okay. It's believed that a cigarette, which was not put out properly, may have caused this fire. Fire crews say that this is a reminder to make sure that your smoke alarms are working properly. And in this case, to also be thankful for a smart pet. Reporting for you live in Southeast Portland, Jessica Morkert, Coin Local 6. Thanks, Jessica.